for its one, two, three, four home runs at the old ball game. Hey, hey, welcome to The Fumble. Thanks so much for tuning in. I am your host, Britt Johnson. For updates on all your favorite MLB players, make sure you click that subscribe button and join the notification gang for updates on all the latest. Tuesday night, the St. Louis Cardinals took on the Cincinnati Reds, and well, a little bit of history was made. That's right, baseball fans, Cincinnati Reds infielder Scooter Jeanette became the 17th player in baseball history to hit not one, not two, but four home runs in one game. Can you name a few other players who are also a part of this elite group? Let me know in the comments below. Well, I'll help you out here a little bit. The most recent player to do so was five years ago when Josh Hamilton did it on May 8th, 2012. He actually played for the Reds at one point in time, but the homers he made were when he was a member of the Texas Rangers. Prior to Josh, it had almost been 10 years since another player hit four home runs in a game, and that goes to Carlos Delgado all the way back in 2003 when he was a member of the Toronto Blue Jays, which I'm pretty sure some of you guys probably weren't even born yet. Lou Gehrig and Willie Mays also make the list. One of the homers was a grand slam, which made Scooter five for five on the night with count em, 10 RBIs. Prior to this game, Scooter had a career total of 38 home runs, only three home runs on this current season, but now has racked up a total of seven on the season. Although I would love to go over all these home runs, we don't have that kind of time today, so let's just take a look at this grand slam by Scooter. And of course, you guessed it, the Reds won the game 13 to one, improving their record to 27 and 30. They are still smack dab in the middle of the NL Central, but only a few games behind the Cubbies and Brewers. So what do you think about this amazing performance by Scooter? At the age of 27, does he still have a bright future ahead of him? Let me know what you think in the comments below and make sure you click subscribe before you go.